All right, let's start. I think they're pretty easy today, so we can go quickly. Number one, developer. This is talking about software developer. So a lot of times they just leave off out the word software. You don't need to say software developer. Opening up Siri to developers, software developers. I was trying to think of another field where they might use that term developers. The only one I could really think of was real estate developers, people who are building some mall or some casino or something like that. You can see the used there. But for the most part, and especially here, it's talking about software developers. Number two, summon up. This is the, a little bit difficult to explain, um, but it kind of means to call upon or to, to summon, to call upon, to do, to call upon, to do. So a lot of times it is used with energy, actually. I summoned up the energy. Even though it seemed like it was not there, or it looked like I was tired, you could not see, kind of think about that part, you could not see it, but I brought it forth. I called upon it. Uh, you can summon a king. It is oftentimes used with the king. The king can summon you to his court. You are coming forward. Um, to summon up, the, there's, there's this example sentence talks about an English teacher summons the student to the front of the class, mm. brings him forward. Mm -hmm. um, here they are, you know, are reading to summon up the WeChat, right? So the WeChat's not there, mm. but you bring it, you, it's just your background or whatever, but then you summon it up, it comes forward. So it's in the background or it's hidden or it doesn't look like it's there, but you bring it forth, you call upon it. Number three, take on. So just to begin to handle, to begin to do, um, it's often used with task assignment, to, to take on this task, to take on this assignment, to take on this project. I will take it on, meaning I will start it, I will begin to work it, I will begin to handle it. And number four, workout. I think you know workout is one word. It can be used as a noun. If it is a verb, possibly uses two words, work out. I'm going to work out. I'm not sure if it's one or two words as a verb. But it can be used noun or verb. That's, that's I guess, the most important thing. And it's quite common. As, like, when I say, what are, you, what are you going to do this evening? I'm going... I guess there's three different ways. I'm going to exercise. It's probably the least common. Mm -hmm. We probably either say, I'm going to work out or I'm going to the gym. Mm -hmm. Same. I'm going to exercise is also fine, but that's probably the least common. Very common to say, oh, I'm going to work out. In that case, it's a verb. Mm -hmm. I'm going to the gym. And then here, I think it is used as a noun, right? Your workout. So they're always coming up with new types of workout, CrossFit, uh, whatever, all these different types of workouts. Any questions about those four words? Yeah, I have one question. Yep. But uh, if I, I usually I go to the high river mm -hmm. to walk, mm -hmm. and in this case, can I use, uh, I will go to workout. Workout is, means uh, the exercise in the indoors, right? You can work out outside, but it's going to be like pull up and push up. And it's more physically strenuous yeah. than just walking. Um, even if you go running, you know, I went running last night along the Han River. I wouldn't say I worked out. A lot of times if you go to the gym, your workout will involve some running. But when you say workout, running might be involved, but there's going to be some type of more physically strenuous exercises involved. Using weights, or there's tons of body weight exercises, push-ups, pull-ups, just squatting, whatever, workout. It's, it sounds more than just walking or running. Okay, and indoor or outdoor is not important? Usually it's going to be indoor in the gym, usually, but you can work out outside but it's going to be, like I said, you know, in the Han River they have places, you could call that a workout, 
where you're doing the pull up and there's some actually they have some weights at some of them too so you can work out at the Han River around those things but it's more than just running or walking any other questions? Um, pronunciation about yes. summon up? Summon Summons. Summon. Summon. Someone is... Not someone. Summon. 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 Yeah. Summon up. Summon up. So it's pretty, we say it fast almost like one more. To summon up. Summon up. Yeah. Any other questions? No?